Oh, how are we going to accommodate so many guests? They aren't even paying. As I've said, Mrs. Russo, the facilities are available to responders and refugees. I am responding to a need to save an addict from the terrifying consequences of indulgence! I suppose your charity doesn't extend to dirty junkies. Is that it? As it stands, I have no way to verify your story. Had you a prior relationship with us, or the victim was present for our medical staff to... Prior relationship? So this is a refuge ruled by nepotism, is it? I deeply apologize for the commotion, darling. We do strive to make every visit to the White Spring a pleasant one. Finally, you've arrived. I was resigned to having to convince this lunatic that my daughter is dying all by myself. Do you know this woman? Ah, wonderful. I believe an apology is in order. Apologies are order to those who deserve them. <clears throat> Nonetheless, it behooves the refuge to help those in need. Perhaps you could provide more coherent details regarding this woman's conundrum? In that case, you will be happy to hear that the leaders of Atlantic City are sponsoring travel for visitors. You might speak to Mr. Jeremiah Hopkins about it, if you haven't already. He has a booth out in the common area, beside the stage. So long as you're willing to provide assistance to the locals during your travels, you may fly to Atlantic City whenever you'd like. Incredible. Was that so difficult? You're graciously welcome for the flight, Mrs. Russo. Now I'm afraid I have other duties to attend to. Lennox shall be happy to board you once your preparations are complete. Excuse me. It baffles me how you're able to deal with that person. I mean, where are they from, the 17th century? Wonderful. I'll be having a drink at the bar until our departure. I'll need it to get me through that dreadful flight. Excuse me! Sorry to interrupt you. I just heard you were going to Atlantic City, and I, uh... It's not safe there. There's a monster. I saw it. People keep going missing. That's why I left. You're not mouthing off about some Jersey devil, are you? What a load of hogwash. My parents told me that story when I was a child to scare me into submission. Well, it didn't work. And no Jersey devil has snatched me from my bed. It's real, I swear. They're siphoning its blood and turning it into a drug. That's why it's so angry now. Marketing tactics. What would you name a cam that's supposed to be the ultimate temptation? Honestly, would you call it innocent angel milk? Siphoning blood. <laughs> no sensible business person would put in all that effort, even if the Jersey Devil was real. Loud. T be careful if you go to Atlantic City. The Jersey. Long ago. Be careful if you go. You did? Oh, we're lucky to be alive. At least I warn you. Keep your eye. Be careful. You never know what's out there.
Oh, did it always smell like this? You would think in a city people could find a civilized place to... The best bet I can... Stan is... Oh, like don't wait up... Communist detected on American soil. Lethal force engaged. You uh, gonna make a necklace out of those caps, or you're gonna invest them wisely at the Neapolitan? Talk of bones crawling out of the barrens. What's a plant gonna do? Antonio was a big hit to the family. Oh, I can't believe that rat ran out on us. Royal Flush again? You must have the angels on your side, my friend. You mean you don't see it, Stan? He's playing you. Ain't nobody got that kind of luck. Oh, come on. You know I'd never play you, Stan. You're the man. <laughs> you know what I love most about you, Stan? How much faith you put in your friends. This is ludicrous. I thought I'd have Oh, to... now what I... you gonna do that for? You really think he was playing me? Come on, Stan. Three royal flushes in a row. Now you grab that cash and take care of your family. I'm headed out. Losing Antonio was a big hit to the... They you looking at something? This is the most Whoa there! Now I can hook you up with all kinds of cats. But as for the blood, what makes you think a nobody like you should get access to Atlantic City's most sought-after cap? Hmm. Well, all right. But first, provide sir. See? And those who don't, you want the blood? Sounds like that should be. I'll meet you out. Wonder how long you here to bet big or what? Mayor Tim fancies himself.
don't you take a load off? Looking for something extraordinary. Apocalypse out there. Paradise in here. Beat it. I'm not your tour guy. Welcome, welcome. Well, tonight. This place is a pocket. And of you? Paradise. Please head. Yeah, we. Yet. <coughs> Gotta admit, there's a certain ch Don't you love this scenery? a flower for you. Oh, I just can't wait to make everyone laugh. It's the soul that's oversized. Not the shoe!
Apocalypse out there? Paradise? In... Every day I see more of the barons in the city. Don't bother me. I'm on vacation. Got it good. What's the We're all just minds in a soundless world. Dibbles, is that finally you? Late on opening night? Who? Oh, get to the stage already! Not just a show. We're all just minds. And <clears throat> Keep up coming! Fun fact! Nothing stimulates a clown's appetite more than a hearty laugh. A hungry clown will prance and frolic to earn a mouthful of their favorite food, delivered with enthusiasm by their jovial leader. Please welcome this giggle of clowns to the stage and bear witness to their feeding frenzy! <laughs> and now, for a classic trick with an explosive twist, watch as this deviously dexterous merrymaker juggles live grenades! oversized, not the shoe! Oh, I just can't wait to make everyone laugh. You? What are you doing here? You followed me, didn't you? You better explain yourself. Of course that would bring you here, of all places. You weren't supposed to know that stage is mine, or at least, then you understand why I have to do this. <laughs> Nonsense. I'm nothing but a failure to them. They have no... <sighs> but I... Is that Evelyn Russo? The disgrace? Oh! Mother has to hear about this! Come back 
care, you pathetic nobody! Well, I don't have much time, but, but before I... So, now, the fine? There's an obvious, uh, but we do know the showman. Well, you sound committed. Remind me not to get in your way in the future. I'll leave the job to you. Night of heart throbbing classics. Where would we be without them? For hundreds of years, art has risked heart and soul, life and limb. So I close with one last visceral threat the curve of blade to neck. <laughs> Tantalizingly close. Assistance! Master of laughs, let loose, and don't you dare gut me. <coughs> this? It isn't... At all, what it looks like. M my costume. The, uh, the layers! Boo! Oh! Oh, it's over! Mother! It's over! Oh, I fooled myself! Uh, they, they all see it. Oh, I've got to get out of here! Where? Where can I hide? Oh, is that wearing my oversized shoes? You think just anyone can hawk and giggle? You made me- I'll make you pay with your buddy bone. <laughs> I'll twist your neck like a balloon. Distinguished guests, crowd, and showmen, brace yourself for an unexpected encore. <laughs> now this impersonating intruder cannot be allowed to leave unpunished. This is now an open fire venue. <laughs> This was supposed to be comedy. Paradise. Oh, oh, living I'm in paradise. the game ah, you ruin me help me ah, don't forget me no need for introductions your entry <laughs> Is 
is a fun house, not a rough house. I heard the news, as promised. Now don't you forget what Stan did for you. What was that? Tell me you have the what dose. You're a lifesaver. All right, Abby. Down. Then? Mom. And... Who are you again? Feels nice. Okay. <laughs> this is just temporary. We need to find you a real solution. An antidote. You got into this abs. Do you know anything about getting off it? 
Well, maybe Dad would have told me if he hadn't cut me out. Everything's dandy now. <laughs> Everything's good. It has to be. Dad? <sighs> Thing, it has to still be in there somewhere. Hey. Thanks. Uh, Abigail? Are you, uh... See what you can get right? out of my father. Dear? Who, me? <laughs> you... You're really asking? Of course, darling. We're going to get you out of this conundrum. If anyone knows how to slink out of a mess... Go talk to my father. Never I'll take care of Abby. You, we'll tackle that when we get to it. Yeah, we will. Won't we? Mm, thanks, Mom. Hang in there, Abs. Oh, it's you! Helping the family out. Oh. Abby, in trouble? She, if only I could have, uh... Abby. I wonder what Pop knows. So what did Pop have to say? Pop, so... Well, if he won't help us... I agree. I remember he would take business trips to the city. He told us he had a warehouse there. If he really was involved with Devil's Blood, though, maybe the family is keeping stock there. Glad you agree. All right, we'll need to borrow that vert. We'll fly into downtown. Let's meet in Atlantic City and go from there. Glowing concoction people drink around here. There has to be someone. Okay, now that we're here, she used to patrol this area. All right, let's... <whistles> uh, that wasn't what I... You're getting into trouble again, I see. Didn't think I'd ever hear that whistle again, Vin. But it sounds as good as ever. Thanks, Sloan. I bet you thought you were rid of Here my poor aim when I left the girl. munis. New you know horizons. I never wanted to be rid of you in the first place, but... Yeah, I really did. Always nice to see some friendly faces. What brings you back to AC, Vin? You bringing me a new recruit? I've come to ask you a favor. The family? Steer clear of them, then. What has you looking for those gangsters, anyway? A cure? Abby's on devil's blood. We're here trying to find an antidote. I know the mob moves in, and it's the perfect place to hide cameras, if they do have a warehouse here. Ben, you know I want to help. I'm only out this way because my squad got... I need to find them. Listen, you're... Really? Like I said, to help Abby... If you insist, I won't turn... And what about you? <laughs> I like that. All right. I saw some of my... Vin and I will take our own path and help others. I have a hunch about where we can find that. Good luck.
Thank you. You saved my life. I could have taken him if I'd had more ammo. My bad day just got a whole lot better. Thank you. Thanks. I thought I was dead meat. After your hiatus. It's nice to know I haven't lost my touch. Oh, that brought back some memories. Missing the good old days? Oh, I don't miss the danger. Right, we need to search for that warehouse. Abby, you should check down this alley. I don't want to fight. If they're guarding a building, Thanks for helping my people. I owe you one. Oh. Missing the good old days? Oh. Right. Abby, you should check. I don't. If they're guarding. Hmm. Will I find anything? I've seen it with my own two eyes. You're pulling my leg. You've There's got no this, way. right? It's true. No! no. It's this ain't, ain't right. right. They're your family, Finn. You did the right thing. That's what I keep telling myself. But there's a part of me that still thinks I... I did wrong... by you. You know I'd love to have you back, Finn. But Abby comes first. I heard you're... Really? I think I know the building you're talking about. We received reports of people slinking around. <laughs> that was dumb of me. Why did Rita say to cross? Hey, the blue one. This is the building the terminal referenced. No obvious way in. There has to be something. Hey, what about these? Let's see what Vin found. We used to use pipes like these to pump the water out, but couldn't we reverse the flow? Or with the right adjustments? Now that you mention it, we did have it. Yes. It's a good plan, Vin. If a municipal op before I go, though, Curing Abby takes... We'll take you back. I'll pull whatever strings are necessary. What do you... I knew this was coming. My family needs me. Des... I need to think about it. I know you will. Think it through. Good luck, Finn. Okay. 
These pumps are finished. The valves are marked with... That's right. Start over. It's three, two, four, one. Whoa, that did it. Let's get in there and clear out what's left. Let's get in there. What the hell was that? Hey, you just whacked the family man. Yeah, you know, right? I still Pray got for me. Fight left. did it okay now we just need to look around and see if there's a cure before we do though i guess it is i never saw myself as someone who would drop everything when my family came begging i'm just not sure what that is right now what would you do in my that's a very blunt assessment maybe i need to give my own happiness you've given me some food for thought now it looks like there's another floor to this place. Well, who do we have here? Hey, hey, look. I just work here, okay? Me? I'm Jean. I cook blood for the family. Wait, why am I answering your questions? A cure for devil's blood addiction? <laughs> that info is what we call classified. You'll have to make me an offer better than the kneecaps. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, okay. Point taken, point taken. Look, I would if I could, okay? I only use synthetic materials. Wasn't always that way. In the good old but if you had that organic compound you could create an antidote can't we get it for you well maybe only the original creep so unless you happen to know where tony russo is hiding now my father damn it pop i knew you had something to do with this wait <laughs> tony is your dad the mafia boss antonio russo oh my god Oh my god, you're Vinny? I really am losing my kneecaps. Seems like we owe my father another visit. <laughs> Senile! Oh, kid! He was barking orders right up until he fled. He's been pulling the wool over your eyes, Vin. He... what? There's no way. Unless... I was pretty busy. And I'd been away from home, working for the Munis for a while. Did I just take it for granted? You're right. Do whatever it takes to make him admit he's been playing us. I know this was a lot to go through. I'll meet you at home when you're ready.
So, you managed to get here in one piece? Yes, of the essence, right. Focus here, Jean.